हाई मैन एम इज राम पवन कुमार वाई वी एडोर ए हीरो ऑफ ए मूवी और द प्रोटोगनिस्ट ऑफ ए नॉवल और ए डाइटी ऑफ एन एपिक इफ यू टेक द एपिक रामायण द सेंट्रल कैरेक्टर ऑफ द एपिक इज लॉर्ड रामा वाई वी एडोर हिम और वर्शिप हिम नॉट बिकॉज ऑफ हिज सुपर नेचुरल पावर्स नॉट बिकॉज ऑफ हिज एसोटेरिक नॉलेज इन फैक्ट he doesn't possess such powers lord rama is associated with his character the central theme of ramayana weaves around two important themes those are keeping the promise keeping the promise given to rama's aunt to stay in woods for 14 years and the second theme is hunting for or searching for Sita these two are the central themes mostly rama never compromised his principles so rama is the height of the character or pinnacle of the character here character always means good character it doesn't means bad character why a hero is famous of a movie or the protagonist of a novel is famous not because he is he can fight and uh, kill anybody or not because of his omnipresence wherever he wants he can present no but because of some principles or character that is why a hero or the protagonist is famous we order them no without much further ado let us come back to our main theme who is a missionary and who is a mercenary 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 always moves with a primary motive of making profit or gain at the same time he compromises his principles or he may lack principles at all but if you take a missionary he always pursues some what the ideal or what the goal which is beneficial to some larger public or public good at the same time he never compromises any principles his framework or constitution is always with a mindset of strong principles what is a what the goal if we take a what the goal what the goal is always difficult to achieve and it involves some hard work and it and it's a journey journey here doesn't mean travel here the journey means moving from one position to some upper position while moving from smaller position to upper position it transforms the person who is pursuing the goal along with his transformation his or her transformation it also transforms the person the people who are associated with that person who is pursuing the goal it's a wonderful journey so a worthy goal must be pursued by everybody not a simple goal and when we can't able to achieve a goal we must not change our goal we must change our course of action If any course of action will involve some variables one of the variable will be your geography and other variable will be your mindset and other variable will be the action you take so we must change these variables one by one must not change all put together if we do or if we change all put together you bring some chaos into the your uh, pursuing goal so you must not change all put together here what i mean to say or what i want to say is a mercenary always pursues a rat race involves in a rat race whatever the money he make whether big or small i say it's a rat race in a mercenary's case always money but in a missionary's case always some objective that is good for public like some uh, in the field of some education in the field of some science in the field of some charity so there are so many uh, missions when religion is also a mission if you believe some religion if you want to proselytize people 
that is also a mission but i am not talking about that mission i am talking about a mission which is good for larger public please understand these subtle nuances so what i ultimately wish to say is a missionary will earn much larger profits or gains than a mercenary without involving much into this rat race at the same time a mercenary involves in a red ocean which where the competition is high in case of a missionary he always involves in a blue ocean because he disrupts the red ocean and he will be a person without any competition see i have seen some people who always disrupts the existing situation or existing well established situation that is the power of a mission if you are a missionary you can transform the world you can transform yourself if you take the business of a mercenary he always tries to micromanage if you take the business of a missionary he always tries to implement good systems that means people will work based on systems not because of some key person is there thank you friends thank you for your patience